guys, in this day and age on YouTube, sometimes when you subscribe to somebody, it doesn't tell you when they upload. So, if you haven't hit that little notification bell under my videos, uh, go ahead and do so, so it actually tells you when I upload. It's amazing, isn't it? Or, you can just join my Discord where I post all my new videos right when I upload. With that, on with the video. No, 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 get over 35, get over 35! No! Here we go! <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome to version 0.12 of Beam and G Drive. That's right, the game has been updated and there's a lot of awesome stuff added in this update. So in this video, I'm going to be doing a quick rundown of all the cool stuff that I that I like in this update. And there's a new car mod, by the way, and it is a big boy. And that's kind of what the uh, the whole update is kind of centered around, is this new vehicle. So we're going to go to grid map and check it out. And there's a couple game modes added around this thing, too. It's pretty awesome. So let's just go to the grid map and test it out, shall we? All righty, guys. So check this thing out. This is the Wentworth DT40L bus, and I believe... This is the biggest vehicle in BeamNG Drive. Well, the biggest dev-created vehicle. I think the T-Series with the trailer is bigger, but this is all one single piece, and it is freaking majestic as heck. Look at this thing. Look at the detail on this thing. We're not in service right now, but we can be. That's, that's the big thing here. Anyway, if we go inside, it's so well detailed, and that is the actual time. Ladies and gentlemen, well, mine reads 104, but yeah, that's the real time there. So it has a real working clock on the, <laughs> on the bus. That's just, that's just crazy to me. So obviously we're going to crash this thing. That's the first thing I thought to do. And we got some ads on the, on the uh, side of this thing too. Point D, make your point. I think that's supposed to be a Sharpie. Anyway, we actually have a few different variants of the Wentworth. As you can see, we have the hero edition, uh, the zebra edition, the base model, the highway, the one we're in right now, the city model, and the safari, which I guess is maybe a little bit better off-road, or it's just, a, you know, a different color scheme. I'm not really sure. Anyway, let's go ahead and crash this thing, just because, you know, obviously, it sounds beautiful. This is the engines in the back, and it's absolutely massive, but yeah, this, is, this thing is awesome. I think it's meant to be kind of paired with the West Coast USA map. Uh, because it does look fantastic there and they actually added in like a bus driver mode <laughs> where you can like have d different routes around West Coast USA and just drive the bus and drop off people it's pretty crazy I haven't I watched the video on it they just uploaded it on YouTube I haven't done it yet but maybe we'll have to give it a shot and there's also a campaign mode here we go get this thing airborne baby yeah <laughs> was that not majestic as heck oh no Hello, there's the engine. Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Look at all that. It's <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. This is the second bus we have in this game now. The first one being a mod, but still a pretty awesome, pretty awesome bus. But this one feels way, 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 way heavier. That is for sure. So, uh, yeah, I think we should run into a car or two just to see how powerful this thing is. So we're just going to put a car at the end over here. And they also have this bus stop. I don't know what it does. At least on the grid map, anyway. You can't run it over, which I was kind of disappointed by. I wish I could just run through it and just break it, but... Unfortunately, you can't. I'm sure there's a reason why. What is this? Track builder. Oh, yeah! I forgot they have a track builder now! I haven't tried this one out either. Where does it start? How do I do this? I have no idea. Uh, but that might be a video for another day, because that seems like its own huge deal. I'm just kind of... I'm just gonna pretty much cover the bus, because that's the big thing added in this update and a lot of other stuff too they kind of fixed they added some sounds into the game like for example uh when your tire is flat you'll actually hear it being flat which is really awesome by the way and uh, a bunch of other stuff engine noises stuff like that and they did it a lot to the um the brake lights they're very they're very realistic now they kind of come they kind of fade in fade out a little bit more realistically anyway we have a covet here that we're just gonna steamroll and uh, is that where it was starting my track oh Okay, well, that makes sense. <laughs> so now you can make tracks without even having to go into the uh, the editor, which is awesome. Okay, don't crash before we get to him. Here we go. Oh, this is a lot of truck. This is a lot of bus heading straight towards this Kovac. I almost feel sorry for him, but then again, 
I also don't. Here we go! <laughs> and that did virtually nothing to our buzz. So what if we just run straight into the wall, though? Then what? Then what happens? <laughs> oh, man. You know, at some point in this video, we're going to have to take this thing to the leap of faith. Obviously. And the car jump arena. Look at it just kind of folds over. There we go. Look at that camera angle. Oh, it's beautiful. And you can you can open all the doors and stuff too. It's pretty it's pretty detailed. All right. So, uh that's the bus. Now, I wanted to try the campaign mode because there's a new campaign mode. Well, it's a tiny campaign mode, but it's still new. It's called Hustle and Bustle. Show off your bus handling skills at Lens Flare Studios. Sounds sounds interesting. So, uh I see fire and uh buses. So, are we going to be reenacting speed? I think we might. Well, let's give it a shot. All right, so we have a prelude here. It says, a normal day at work. Safely transport your passengers down the mountain. We're on top of a mountain? Well, I guess we are. More of a hill. But uh, anyway, so let's get these passengers, all zero of them, down to the bottom of the hill safely. And then I think we're going to be getting into some serious car crashing action. So I'm excited, and I love the way this thing handles. I've always wanted a giant bus in this game. I think all of us have secretly. Even if you, even if you didn't know you did, I think now you realize that you wanted it. And you can't wait to play with it. And it's actually pretty uh, easy on the computer. It's not stressing it out too much like uh, big vehicles usually do. But I think that's just a testament to how well this game has been optimized. Well, or, or continues to get optimized. Because in the in the beginning, it was pretty rough. You couldn't you could run maybe two or three cars before it started to get laggy. Now, I can run like 10 or 15. And with belezes and giant trucks and stuff like that and still be fine. So, there's a bomb on board! Oh, God! No! <laughs> Oh, Jesus! How did I not see that? Where am I going? 35? I can't go under 35, can I? It is reenacting speed! I knew it! <laughs> That's awesome! No! No! Keep going! Keep going! Uh-oh, we're gonna explode. No, 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 get over 35! Get over 35! No! <laughs> oh, that's awesome! Oh no, we exploded. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Devs, devs, I freaking love you. That is amazing. I hope you guys see this around the office. This is, this <laughs> got me. that got me, man. I was thinking, are they going to, they got to do something with speed, right? Yep. Bomb. You can't go under 35. It's beautiful, man. And I love the way it just kind of folds away and shows the, the timer behind it. Oh, that is amazing. All right, so I think it was that turn that kind of messed me up that got me under 35. So I need to make that not happen again. I might need to hop the curb, but I'm scared. I don't know how this thing's going to react to it. So, uh, yeah, this thing is not the fastest bus in the world. That is for sure. Yes, there's a bomb. Oh, God. Jesus. How do I, uh... How do I how do I do this without crashing? I I'm trying to think, trying to think, trying to think. Oh God! Oh no 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 no. Okay. Oh no 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 no. We're gonna explode again. Oh Jesus! Well, <sighs> the Grim Reaper's coming for me. Here we go. Let's embrace it. Three, two, one. <laughs> Man, this is actually this actually seems uh, a little bit difficult. Maybe I can like drift the car. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll have to drift this thing. I don't even know if you can drift this thing. It's, it's massive. All right, come on. We got this. We got this. It's not that hard. Yes. Bomb. I see you. All right, so I'm going to... I'm just going to try to slow down a lot. But not under 35, mind you. So I can actually make this turn. Hopefully. That's that's the that's the hope here, so... Oh, God. Jesus. Uh, come on. Get up to 30. Oh, I broke the tires. How? How am I supposed to do this? Mm. There you go. Great. <laughs> At least there's nobody on board, right? You know, I didn't expect this to be this hard. It's just that one turn. But I can't I can't get my car to go around that or I can't get the bus to go around the turn that fast because obviously it's a bu it's a bus. It doesn't like to go around turns that easily. So, what the deuce? How am I supposed to do it? I think I'm actually supposed to drift it, but I, I currently have my drift button set to something else because of that plane, uh, that that bolide plane. So if I be, able, I should probably remap that, huh? <laughs> I 
<laughs> I think I got it now, though. I think I got it. There it is. There it is. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Rescue incoming. Thank you. Oh, God. We're still... Oh, no. Get up to 35. Get up to 35. There we go. There we go. Rescue incoming. No! What happened? What happened? Why did it explode? <laughs> No! I think I damaged the bus too much. Dang it! Oh, man. Oh. You know what? I think this, this thing's gonna have to be its own video because this is difficult, ladies and gentlemen. And I got some other stuff to show you. So for now, I think we're gonna skip this. I think we're gonna move on. And uh, I'm gonna make a video on this thing tomorrow. So expect this tomorrow but for now <laughs> jesus man that is freaking difficult but i love it that is so freaking cool that is so cool and i'm excited to see where uh where that story takes us all right so you'll also see a bus routes uh kind of gameplay mode here so yeah let's try this one out i guess i'll try it on west coast usa why the heck not uh we'll do oh god start diner sure so basically, this is exactly what it sounds like. This is more of the, uh, more of the, uh, the simulation aspect of this game. I like this game does it all and usually does it as best as, like, the best simulators out there. This might be better than the actual bus simulator for all I know. I know there is one, by the way. But, uh, this is, uh, straight up just bus simulator. You drive people around. It's not like a crazy taxi or anything, but it's, it's pretty realistic. And I know a lot of people are really gonna appreciate that. All right, so let's start our route here. We just got our basic freaking bus, and it says start diner. All right, so we need to snooze news. <laughs> Is that where we're going? I guess so. And we even get a little line. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, I love that. So we started. Is this snooze news right here? Is this where we're starting? Yes, it is. All right, so we need to slow down and then go right here. Perfect. Perfect. There we go. Stop the bus. Stop the bus. There we go. Kneel the bus. Uh, how do I do that? How, how do I do that? How do I do that? It is... G button. Oh, look at that! <laughs> it kneels the bus down! Okay, so do we need to open the bus? I already did that. Or do I need to go farther? Or is that it? Oh, open the doors. Okay, cool. So, do that. There we go. Looking good! Wait five seconds! Isn't this action-packed, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Isn't this awesome? Close the doors. Get him up there. Oh, no. Whoops. Shut him. Shut him. Takes a second. Definitely takes a second. Raise the bus. There we go. And we're off to the next place. Where are we going next? Canal Street? There's a lot of uh, routes on here. Holy crap. Wow. So, yeah. This is the uh, the bus mode. It's pretty simple, but um, pretty awesome at the same time. If you're If you're into that sort of thing... I know there's no people in this game, at least yet, but it's still really freaking cool. And look at the detail in here, man. It's just awesome. So I'll go ahead and do one more one more stop here real quick. And then we're going to go to the good old car jump arena and see how far this thing can go. And the leap of faith as well. Whoa! Okay. 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 It's right there. Oh, my God. Okay. Almost missed it. I was going too fast, but that's all right. That's all right. All right. Kneel the bus. Open the doors. Come on, there you go. Wait five seconds! Get on, come on, people. Come on, come on. I like how it changes the camera, too, automatically. I'm not doing that. And then kneel it up, and there we go! So we did it! We still got some more uh, stops, but you guys get the premise. You guys get it. It's pretty awesome. I love it. All right, so let's wreck this freaking bus, shall we? So we're going to go to Car Jump Arena and uh, see how far she can fly. Should be interesting, huh? Huh. This, uh... This doesn't look right. Does this have rockets on it? No. No way. No way. And a giant cape? Oh my god, it's adorable! Hold on. Why is my bus like this? Uh-oh. Might need to go into the editor real quick. Okay, don't flip over, don't flip over. Do we have do we have rocket boosters? I need to know. I need to know. I don't think we do. Dang it! Oh wait, yeah, oh my god, yeah, we do! Holy <laughs> Oh my god! That is awesome! What? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh my god. Look at this. Look at those things, guys. Look at this. 
Oh, yes. Holy crap, that is awesome. Here we go. <laughs> oh my god. A flying bus. Ladies and gentlemen, oh my god. This is too much. Devs, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, so... Obviously, I have a couple videos to make now because uh, this thing in itself deserves a video. So be on the lookout for a video on the rocket bus and on the uh, the hustle and bustle uh, campaign. It should be pretty awesome. So be on the lookout for that. But until then, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Oh, man. This is awesome.